what's up everyone, welcome back. I know that I said I was gonna take a break from EMC, but you know, I miss you guys. I uh, wanna share my life with you guys. And I thought a lot lately about what I want to share. You guys are always seeing a side of me that, you know, it's either you know, on my TV shows or movies or EMC. I kind of just want to show you guys my daily life and what I like doing, my hobbies, my passion, besides cars. Um, tattoos have been a huge part of my life ever since I was 17. I have always liked traditional style tattoos and my artist uh, is also my big bro, Fu Ge from Diao Fu Ziqing. But uh, because of Empire Aqua, you know, I, I love marine life and I love conservation and I wanted to just dedicate ocean animals on one side of my leg or just one part of my leg. I had Dr. Wu uh, who worked on a great white design as well as a whale shark. But lately, I guess during COVID, I really wanted to continue the theme of marine life animals that mean a lot to me, to Dizzy, and you know, that just reminds me of happiness and reminds me of what I do for Empire Aqua, what I do for the ocean, and I just want to share that with you guys. So this vlog will be just more about tattoos and what they mean to me, but I'm going to introduce a very special artist today. It's not easy to book here. Uh, my good friend Warren Kim, he introduced me to this amazing artist. His name is Axe, and we are at Axe's studio right now, and this is called Black Box Inc. And you know, I'm gonna let him just kind of introduce himself. Axe, Jason Hello, it's Axe. Then our company is called Black Box Inc. Yeah. Then our company is usually made of tattoos. 做一些比较细致一些之类的风格比较多你要不要讲一下我们这次的设计原本大特务的设计就是做两边比较对称所以我就是希望让你整只脚是都是对称一点后面我会搭配一些线就是去带一些视觉上的效果就是整体起来看起
This is like something that I've always wanted to bring it up on social media because I've had tattoos for over 20 years now. I didn't become an actor until I was like what was that, 29, 10 years ago. Wow, I've been acting for 10 years. And I remember when I first started, everyone was like, well, you got too many tattoos, you're not gonna make it. But you know, times are changing. Obviously, if it was 15, 20 years ago, uh, I don't think I would have the opportunities and the chances that I would have today. And I don't think I would be as socially accepted as I am today. And, you know, thank God for social media. Thank God for pop culture. Thank God for all the rappers and all the athletes and all the role models out there that have made tattoos very popular and acceptable. And I guess I'm also one of them. I don't wanna make it seem like, oh, like I was like the first. I'm obviously not the first, but I was one of the very first, at least uh, in Asia, to be a celebrity with full body tats. And you know, when I do talk to a lot of the older tattoo artists, um, they say I'm, I'm one of the influential figures that started the trend. You know, this is, a, this is an interesting topic, so I would love to hear what you guys think about tattoos and about if tattoos have a good connotation or a bad connotation. Obviously, the tattoos that I have are considered traditional tattoos. You know, within the Asian cultures, these kind of tattoos are associated with, you know, gangsters, the mafia. Although I used to be a very, 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 very bad guy, but I am extremely good. And, you know, I, I'm Mr. Nice Guy now. So, yeah, let me know what you guys think. We're gonna keep getting tagged up in a little update. Yeah, it's starting to hurt. It's starting to hurt a lot. See you guys in a bit. What's up guys, so I am back. The healing process was pretty good, I have to say. Uh, it looks pretty much almost 99.99999% just like uh, the design was. It's very, very realistic. I love it. Axe is a great artist. So if you guys want to get some really dope work done, especially with single needle work, you guys got to come to Black Box. But I'm here for the second session and we're probably gonna work on the manta ray today. And if we have enough time, we're gonna get on with the hammerhead. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna start shaving now. All right, see you guys. of these ocean animals they actually have a lot of meaning uh, the great white shark it reminded me of our honeymoon so Dizzy and I right after we got married we went to the south of Australia and we decided to go find great white sharks you know we went cage diving with great white sharks and that was that was an amazing experience and the whale shark reminds me of Dizzy because she's like my whale shark and it's difficult to find another whale shark just like yourself and uh, it's kind of like we're soulmates so that reminds me of Dizzy as well she's my whale shark and together we love the ocean so much that's why I wanted to get other ocean animals octopus for me is just you know when I first saw them they were able to change colors and adapt they're so smart and they're so strange at the same time you know and I feel like their IQ is probably off the charts 
And if they were able to communicate with us through their body, I bet you, if we spend more time with them, we could probably understand what they're saying or what they're trying to tell us. And manta rays is super important for us. We were in the Maldives at Huravali, and they work with the Manta Trust, which is a manta ray foundation. And this manta ray foundation, Empire Aqua works with now. And it is through that one time where the Manta Trust and Huravali, they took us out to go find manta rays. And when we saw them, you know, after a couple hours being on the boat, it was just mesmerizing. You know, it was one of those experiences that you always remember for a lifetime. And they're just so beautiful and so majestic. I just needed to get a manta ray on me. Um, it just reminds me of the moments in life. It reminds me of memories. It reminds me of how important they are to the ocean. All right, man, so we're gonna come to an end for this vlog right now. Uh, as you can tell, we just finished the manta ray. I am super, super happy with this. Uh, Axe worked wonders. Very skilled, very talented young artist. And I support young artists, man, I really do. If you guys want single needle tattoos or, you know, like very, very, very dope and realistic style, come to Black Box, man. Yeah, I hope you guys like this kind of vlog, uh, just kind of documenting my life, the stuff I like to do and I want to share with you guys. So if I get more tattoos, you guys will definitely see it on the vlogs. But anyway, I'll see you guys on the next one. Hope you guys enjoy. Peace. Hi, we are Hei Hei Shi Qing. I am Zink. I am the most famous in the black box. My IG is T-A-T-T-O-O-I-S-T. Zink. Hi, I am Louis. My black box is the black box and the black box. And some stuff. And my IG is here. Can you help me? Okay. Hello, I am X. 我擅长的是就是细致的写实事情，然后可能有时候会搭配一些线性或实验性的元素去做一些视觉上的变化。对 ，Hello， 大家好，我是黑盒电子力，我叫 A 等。如果有什么问题的话，可以私信我们的 IG， 谢谢。All right, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed that vlog. Uh, we're gonna heal up. We're gonna come back, obviously, but hope you guys enjoyed the vlog. I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.